I am so excited to get stuck into making videos again. This feels like a whole new clean slate starting now. I went to a convention recently and a lot of people were telling me one of their favorite video series I did was the randomly generated AI pick me Nintendo Switch games. I have a love-hate relationship with these videos. Some of them do really well in the algorithm and then some absolutely tank like the time I tried to have an AI girlfriend pick me my games. Honestly, don't really even know what I was thinking with that one. <laughs> so we're taking it back old school. I'm going back to NSG reviews and using their I'm feeling lucky feature, a feature that was added to this website because of my video, by the way. This is your last chance to watch, like, subscribe, and enjoy these videos because if you little piss ants don't show up, <laughs> I'm never bringing back this series again. That was a little harsh. I really enjoy making these. I'm just kidding. Here are the rules. If I have the game already, I have to re-roll. I need to buy anything that gets rolled. There's no take back -sies. Let's begin. I'm feeling lucky, baby. What Switch game am I buying first? Oh God, what is this? Feeling lucky. Hide and dance? What? Uh Okay. I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling lucky. Wonder Jar, try again or walk away? Is that a recommendation for re-rolling? Are they trying to say re-roll? <laughs> like, I'm feeling lucky, but I shouldn't be after those three. Are you kidding me? 7,754 games. And I roll Garfield Kart Furious Racing. <laughs> Desperately trying to remember if I've played this, because something tells me I have. My buddy RGT85 has a love-hate relationship with this game. His video is on the review page. Maybe it's good. I don't know. Stella Interface. Another one I've never seen before. The next role will be my new favorite Nintendo Switch game. Oh, well, actually, it might be. I... <laughs> I'm really not having bad luck here. I've actually had my eye on Omen Sight for a while, and I just haven't got around to buying it yet. But it actually does look pretty sick. I don't think I could lose today. I think I should go to the casino. I think I'm on a hot streak. All right, well, it had to come to an end somewhere. Four Oh, that one hurts. Oh, what the heck is this game? This looks like a My Life with Horses game. I was going to pretend for a second. I was going to lie and say that I have this so that I didn't have to buy it. And then I saw it was on sale for $3. So fine, I will buy that. I will buy that. No, I don't have it. Yes, I was about to lie for the video. I actually feel like other than the two space shooters, we have a nice diverse list of games to look at. I'm very excited, actually. No, that's fine. $10. It's a car game. It has no reviews and no ratings. We might be the first person on the internet to... Nope, never mind. All right, let's go to the eShop and buy all of these and then see what the tally actually is today. Remote slide. 27? Oh, I'm on the Australian eShop. Woo! Just about had a heart attack. Zach's probably going to cut this out of the video. It's such a stupid name for a game. Oh, it has a demo. Can I do that instead? No, that's not the rule. So we have a deluxe edition. It must have sold pretty decently. Maybe people like it. I knew, I knew I'd already bought it at some point. I promise you though, I never played it. I'm just gonna re-download it and play it for the first time. That's why I love making these videos because it's so much fun to play these random games. I say that as I type in the good life, which I don't think I'm going to like. Oh, this one's gonna hurt boys. This one's gonna hurt. Mechanic battle. It doesn't really sound like a car racing game, does it? It sounds more like two car mechanics about to fight with wrenches. <laughs> that is everything. I I think all up, it was about $150. I think this might be my favorite selection of games so far. It's a good mix of, I might like this to this will be funny to play. We gotta wait for all these to download and it probably will take a couple hours. I don't know what we can do for a couple of hours. Well, oh, uh, I have an idea. <laughs> it's, a, it's a little something called uh, sponsor time, baby. Oh, I'm down, I'm down. I mean, I I just spent a lot of money, so if you could make some back, that would be great. Okay, I'm gonna, yeah, yeah, yeah that guy now. <laughs> this guy now. Uh, so often I get asked the question, Wood, why don't you do two of you on screen at the same time with the sponsor reads anymore? And, um, yeah, you know, I was just about to ask that. Well, it's because I forgot how. 
So it's probably time I relearned using, hmm, how about Skillshare? Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for anyone who loves learning and wants to explore their creativity and learn new skills. For me personally, it's been a fantastic source of knowledge because it might surprise you to find out, but I didn't exactly study how to do any of this. But Skillshare's classes have taught me everything from how to use a camera correctly to video editing in Premiere and applying cool effects in After Effects. I can never recommend Geordie's classes in video editing enough for both beginners and more advanced editors. But that's just me. There's everything on Skillshare from graphic design and illustration to cooking and gardening. Here's a class by successful YouTuber Marcus Brown on how to be a successful YouTuber. Maybe you should take yeah. that class. I just <laughs> learned how to edit you back into the video and I can just as easily edit uh, you out. Uh, 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 Skillshare is ad free with new premium classes launching every week. There you go. <laughs> so for the first 1000 of you to click my link in the description, you will get a one month free trial of Skillshare. It's time to be the best you that you can be. Well, maybe you should. Here's why I don't do these anymore, by the way. Omen sites taking forever, but a lot of them are done. The very first one, which is remote life. I do appreciate that I can dive straight into the game. If I suck at the game, I'll bear that in mind that I skipped the tutorial. So off the bat, I'll say that visually, I kind like this style. I picked up a couple of upgrades and now my gun is doing this like freaky pattern thing and I'm kind of here for it. The hyper jump was successful. I can see the outer hull. I've played a lot of like these indie games. So many of them do text to speech for the narration in the game. It comes across as so budget. Hate, I hate, I, ugh. The music is fire though. <laughs> I feel like I'm in a 90s rave. I was too young to go to raves in the 90s, but that's where it feels like I am. This is what I imagine raves were like in the 90s. Kind of really liking the weird design of everything. All right, well, that's that's remote life. It's, 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 it's hard with me. I find the space shoot 'em up genre is a dime a dozen and none of them really appeal to me. I will say that one felt pretty good. Visuals were pretty good. It's just not my kind of game. Oh, but now, freaking Garfield caught my guy i'm gonna call sean i think this might be his old number i don't know if i have his new number anymore about to get big timed by rgt85 all right fine sean you don't get to be in my video game number two garfield card why do i feel like i've played this before oh I have, because I have save history here. How am I at the point where I've played so many Switch games, I don't even realize that I've played them before and I buy them again. That means I have the physical somewhere buried in that wall of games. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think I played this with Kim. What is this weird recollection I have of playing this? Whatever. So we have drifting, just like in Mario Kart. I don't know what just happened there. There is lasagna and lasagna, of course, lasagna is the speed boost. You know the one food that couldn't make me feel any more sluggish and slow? Lasagna. I'm not running a marathon after eating a bowl of lasagna. I just keep getting lasagna. I've got four items now and it's all been lasagna. Give me something different, give me something different. Lasagna. Now Sean is calling me back. Hello? Hello, who it is? I, uh, uh, Wood? Is this Sean? No. Okay, I guess his number must have changed at some point. It was very nice to meet you. No! Nah. <laughs> what just happened? Is there nothing else to help me catch up a little bit other than a speed boost for like a second? I just keep getting lasagna! I can't recommend buying that one. The frame rate seemed a little all over the place too. Not, definitely not 60 FPS like Mario Kart. From the great developers who made such games as My Mum Stole My Game Boy comes Hide and Seek. Ready, go! One, two, three. Whoa, 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 what is happening? What is happening? Low, 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 behind you, behind you? <laughs> what? Shoopy, shoopy, shoopy. 
Shoopies, shoopies. <laughs> no, I'm sleeping. I'm sleeping. Shoopies, shoopies, shoopies. But uh, not me. It's a suit of armor. Oh, hide. Oh, I'm working out. I'm not dancing, Mom. I promise. Why would I be dancing? Dandy, 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 dandy. Not me, Mom. I'm tiny now. Okay. All right. You know what? You know what? You know what? Kind of like that. That's pretty funny. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. Hide from Mommy. Boom, boom, ba. I'm a piece of wood. Hey, it's me. <laughs> hey, uh, I kind of like the music, too. I hate to say, that's my favorite one so far. It's $5. It's simple. It's dumb. The music kind of slaps. There's no way I'm going to like this one nearly as much. Oh my god. What am I looking at? We've received reports that monsters are rampaging in the city. Our mission is to eliminate them all. Wait, before I make fun of this too much, is this just like a really old game that was ported to Switch? No, it was released in 2016. Okay. Why is this giving me plants versus zombies vibe? What's with the lag? Press Y to pick up jewels. Okay. Oh my god, there's so much lag and frame skipping. You place characters on the battlefield and they just kind of start battling laggily. And then when they kill something, you have to press Y to pick up anything that it drops. A new member has arrived. Jasmine. Oh my god, the lag is insane. It keeps stuttering. Even the music cuts out. It did it again! Really, the only thing I have to say right now that I like as it lags more is the character design is pretty cute. But everything else is really bad. Oh my god. Zach, can you just play the soundbite of everything that just happened? Oh, it keeps happening. I'm not making it up. It's constant. I can't even... What is happening? I can't grab this and move it around. It just jumps to wherever I'm touching. Oh, finally. Just in time to close it and never play it again. We'll dive into the other space game. I'm already liking the visuals a lot. Ooh, I'm vibing with this. Crank it up, Zach. Crank it up. Woo! Oh, I like that music a lot. Zach, what? Go into 11. Turn it up to 11. I like this one. Okay, everyone, this next song goes out to everybody watching at home. Let me hear you. Let's stand up. Never giving up, fighting till we get to the top. Never giving up, we're shooting our way to the top. Never giving up, never giving up. Playing all the randomly generated AI games. And yes, I said AI, I got it wrong, but I can't change it. Now I'm doing it on the fly, because I'm flying in the spaceship. Up in the sky, and I'm shooting everything that comes by. That I'm never gonna stop, never gonna stop, never gonna give up. Because I'm too good, now that coming from the bottom of the screen doesn't bother me. I will kill anything, you can't bother me, you can't bother me, smother me. Get in the ground and uh, yeah, let's that is the winning shoot 'em up for the day. I like that one. Time for Omen Sight. Oh, I have save data already. Oh my God, what is my problem? I haven't played this. At the very most, I loaded it up. Prosperous land, home to many tribes. Okay, got voice acting. I like it. It's the most quality feeling game so far already. I definitely haven't seen this cutscene because that bear is sick and I would have remembered him. Oh, this looks sick. I don't remember this at all. Ooh, a little bit of hack and slashy. Dodging, flipping, like the art style. Might be onto something. <gasps> no! Bad game, bad game. Kind of fun, kind of fun game, kind of fun game, but bad game. Can I revive the bear? I will keep playing if it brings the... That doesn't look alive. Oh, wait, I'm bonded with his soul. Do I get like bear powers now? Really liking this combat though. Love the visuals, this cell shaded style. Kind of like a darker color scheme, but like highlighted by purple. You can tell I kind of love that because it's essentially what I've got set up in my room right now. I am going to play more of this one. I like that and I want to put it in an eShop video. I'm going to play the one where mechanics fight each other with spanners. That logo looked like a butt. Apparently I can't use a pro controller for this one. I have to use Joy-Cons. I wonder why. I'm diving straight in. 
Literally, it took five seconds to get here. Out of my way! I'm coming through. Why am I slowing down? What is happening? Go, go, go. What am I doing wrong? Visually, it's actually better than I thought. I'm not really about this like top-down car racing little micro machines feel. I'm kind of catching up to the guy in first. Nah, he might be about the same. No! Oh, that sucks. That slowed me down so much. Oh, look how close I got. Kind of proud of that. $600 subscription due to... Oh, what? My camera just died. So you can't see the face I'm making. Maybe the camera thought I was ugly as well. While I was waiting for the camera to come back on, I messed around. It looks like there's some customization options for the cars, some unlockable cars, but it looks very light. Like it looks like a free to play mobile game. I definitely wouldn't recommend anyone buy that. Rock of Ages 2. I have actually heard good things about this game. It's very Monty Python looking. <laughs> okay. All right. Hold on. Am I going to like this? I'm kind of liking this. This is funny. Oh, I get to roll around this menu. Look at me. I love this. This is my humor. This is so stupid. Please let the game be fun. Oh, I just get to roll. Oh, I, I like have full control. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. I messed up. Let me try that again. Here I come. 193. Oh, I can put things down. We'll just experiment and see what this stuff does. All right. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Oh, he blew right through it. Stop. 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 I, I slowed him down quite a bit. Oh, all right. Here I go. Oh, now he's put down defenses. Ugh. Whoa. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Here I come. Here I come. <laughs> this time I'm not going to get hit by his elephant. I love the noises everything makes as I blow past. Woo! Hello! Squish! Oh my god. I'm gonna check this one out more as well. I can't tell you how much I enjoy making these videos. I had a ton of fun today. What's that? I didn't play uh what one of them? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm pretty sure I played them all and had a good time. Had a good time. Had a good life. The good the good life. Oh, the good life, right. No, I wasn't trying to get away without playing this. Without playing this? No. Limited run? Why is limited run in the title screen for this game? Wait, this game has a very positive 9 out of 10 score on Steam? Is that a meme? All right, we got a little sweeping cutscene. I'm gonna ignore the trees popping in and out. I mean... This feels kind of high produced so far. They used to call it the happiest turn in the world. But that was over 30 turn? years. Turn? Zach, how accurate is this accent? This is a very cute town. I know that it... Kim? What a goddamn hellhole. Kind of liking the attitude this one has. We were gifted a house from the town? That seems a little far-fetched. This chick's gonna kill me. This has massive riding stable horses game vibes, but definitely better. Polished. No idea what kind of game this could possibly be. This is cute. This is a cute town. I'm trying not to like this game right now. Is that weird? Because for the memes, I feel like I should hate this. The garden's a mess. It's more of a dump than I expected it to be. It's not even close to the town. It took me maybe 15 seconds to get here. Okay, so it has to be a photo taking game. So I can upload this photo right now. And it takes forever for the photo to upload because I live in the middle of nowhere. So I head back into town and take photos. Okay, so it is a photo taking game. <gasps> oh yeah, I want to take a photo of the mouse. But there's a photo of a nice mouse. Like this like nice photo right here. That's nice. This is cheating a little, but I'm going to bring up a review. Your goals are to take photos and uncover the secret to the town's happiness in order to pay off your tremendous debt. You quickly learn the townspeople turn into dogs or cats on the night of the full moon, and soon enough, you can too. Kind of a spoiler, actually. It would have been nice if I had discovered that on my own. I kind of ruined that, actually. It looks like it's actually pretty ambitious. It's pretty cute, but there's a lot of different mechanics. You turn into a cat or dog to help progress the story and that you can explore as like the animals. And then during the day, there's a lot of like taking pictures of subjects and like trying to pay back your debt. This isn't bad. It's way more than I thought it was. And I think I was too mean and judged it way too hard by a cover before playing it. Kind of anticlimactically, we've just kind of ended with a game that is actually pretty good. I love making videos like these. I don't know if this is, if you, if this will do well or if you liked it. So like the video, subscribe, hit the bell, all of that. If you like it, I'll do another one. Bye.